I'm a co-founder of Mars One, and Mars One is organizing a manned mission to Mars in 2023 and uh, sending every two years another crew to Mars. The special thing about our project is we're doing this with existing technology, which is possible because we are sending uh, the crews on missions of permanent settlement. They're staying on Mars. And for me, the inspiration was the uh, Sojourner rover in 1997. Uh, when I saw the pictures uh, of that rover from Mars uh, coming to Earth. For some reason I wanted to go to Mars and go to that planet, explore it, build things there. And, and that has been my drive uh, all along. So I'm here to tell people a bit about what it's like to try and survive the rigors of spaceflight. So I, I think that Mars is within our capability. I, I'm pretty sure we will go at some time in this century, only because we're quite early in the century and so much was achieved you know, in, in, in the last hundred years that we would never have expected. But it's a tricky mission. Uh, there are lots of things that can go wrong. We so far have never had only a, a, a fraction of a crew injured and killed in a mission. Either the engineering works and everyone lives or it doesn't and everyone dies. There are a lot of hurdles to be taken. There's a lot of engineering to be done. There's a lot of solutions to be found, but the technology exists. We don't have to do any new inventions. And what a lot of the people who criticize the Mars mission don't realize is it's a one-way mission. And that changes everything. It suddenly becomes a lot more uh, feasible if you forget about the return mission, because it's easier to sustain human life on Mars than it is to send people back. Assuming the rockets do work, then, then there's the problems of life support, radiation, weightlessness, vacuum of space, all of that. Uh, and so, yeah, it's a pretty tough environment. I mean, it'll, it'll feel like any expedition. You'll feel pretty unwell at the end of it. So if people are interested to find out more about our project, go to our website. It's uh, mars-one.com. And uh, there's a big FAQ where people can find answers to all their questions.